I'm not usually this mean, but it seems like Father Time bitch slapped these celebrities in the face. I'm Megan, your host of Celebrity Facts, and today I will be hosting this episode of Bored Badger, where we talk about the top 10 celebrities who have aged badly. Can I persuade you to take a sandwich with you, sir? I'll get drive through. If only we had known how profound this line would be to Val Kilmer's career. As it turns out, this very committed actor took his line extremely seriously because it seems like Mr. Kilmer went to every drive through in the country over the past 20 years. I respect method actors, but come on, Val, the movie's over. The easy joke would be to say that he's gone from Batman to Fat Man, but I'm not that mean. All right, maybe I am. Bond. James Bond, suave, sophisticated, cool under pressure, and the ultimate heartthrob. Ah, uh, stop swooning, Megan. These are the things Pierce Brosnan used to be. He's since then given up all this to become a new type of hero. The type of hero the world needs more so than James Bond. He's now a middle-aged dad with a serious dad bod. These are the unsung heroes of the world who save the world one beer gut at a time. Sure, he's had to give up fast cars, sexy girls like you, and martinis that are shaken, not stirred. But take a look at him in those middle-aged dad shorts and tell me he's not the happiest man alive. Before we get into number eight, I really need to stick up for this celeb because this poor actress has not been given the accolades that she deserves for being a courageous woman. That's all been going to one Miss Caitlyn Jenner recently. While I do agree that it's courageous to be the first celebrity to have a sex change, I think that Renee needs some credit for being the first celebrity to get a face change. Good point, Megan. I mean, going from a cute petite blonde to an unrecognizable mess takes some massive balls. Um, Angelo, maybe that was a poor choice of words. I see dead people. Good job, Megan, because all I see is one weird f***ing dude. I mean, I do feel sorry for Haley Joel, though, because it's not that he aged badly, it's just that his head grew faster than his face. Poor guy. Yeah, you know, it must be hard as hell being a child star. I mean, think about it. At first, everyone thinks you're cute. All you have to do is say your lines, and everyone thinks you're a genius. You get paid millions, and you never even have to go to school. Then you turn 18, and bam, the world f***ing hates you. I mean, really hates you. Well, nevertheless, best of luck, Haley. Maybe soon you'll stop seeing dead people and start seeing another major movie role. Sliding down the barrel at number six, we have Lindsay Lohan. You know what? Everyone gives Lindsay a hard time for her downward spiral, but I'm here to tell you some hot gossip. Lindsay Lohan is not out of control at all. She's just been practicing for her latest movie role, Freaky Friday 2. So in the original Freaky Friday, Lindsay's character swaps bodies with her mom, played by Jamie Lee Curtis. But in the sequel, she actually swaps bodies with her inappropriate, divorced, drunken, slightly bisexual, uber slut of an aunt. Director Mark Waters stated that so far she is really nailing her character, but does question why she's been practicing for over a decade. Dancing in at number five is John Travolta. I mean, what a career this man has had. From early smash hits like Saturday Night Fever and Grease to his amazing comeback in Pulp Fiction, there's no denying that this man won over a legion of female fans in his prime. Only problem is those female fans are now booging the night away in nursing homes instead of the cinemas. Has John Travolta really lost his looks? Hell yeah. Honestly, I'd love to meet him someday. My car needs to be repainted, and I could really use the number of the guy that sprays his hair on for every movie. Hey, look, Megan, it's a malnourished dog. Oh, wait, is that just Macaulay Culkin? Wow, no wonder there's been rumors going around that he's dead. I mean, he does look like a walking corpse. Hey, Megan, what was it again that Mr. Mackey taught us on South Park? Don't do drugs, okay? Drugs are bad. If you do drugs, you're bad, okay? If only Mr. Culkin had taken this advice, he might still look like the cute cheap kid that we all remember from Home Alone, instead of an elderly AIDS patient. Waddling along at number three is the skinny turned fat, turned skinny, turned fat, turned back to skinny, and fat once more, 
Kirstie Alley. We all know her as the funny babe from Cheers and Look Who's Talking, but nowadays she probably gets more camera time on peopleofwalmart.com than the big screen. But like a true champ, Kirstie is back on her feet and doing great. She recently starred in the reality show Time Crashers, which is about celebrities experiencing what it's like to live in a past era. I hear Kirstie demanded to go back to 1989 to experience what it's like to still be relevant but the producers said no. Ah, uh, Mickey Rourke. You may know him from his early work in movies like Diner, Rumblefish, or his return to film in Sin City. Or maybe you remember him from his time as a professional boxer. For me, he'll always be remembered for his dedication in transforming himself into a real life elephant man. He did this, of course, as a tribute to actor John Hurt, who originally played the role back in 1980. The only difference is Mr. Hurt would spend hours and hours in a grueling prosthetics routine to get ready. Mr. Rourke, eh, he just kinda woke up like this. Now for our number one celebrity who's aged badly. For more celebrity facts, subscribe here. And the number one celebrity who has not taken kindly to aging is celebrity royalty and fitness fanatic, Madonna. Rumor has it that Madonna was inspired to get into shape and acquire the perfect body after seeing an amazing photo on the wall of her doctor's office. Little did we know that this fitness photo was actually a diagram of a skeleton. Not to be put off, Madonna has strived hard to achieve her goals and did just that. I mean, look at those arms. Jesus Christ, you're right. Madonna used to be every young man's fantasy back in the 80s and it's hard to imagine the queen of pop being any other way. But in her pursuit of perfection, she's transformed herself into every man's nightmare. I mean, just ask Drake. He's still looking for some good mouthwash to get rid of the taste. Click here to check out our video on 15 celebrities you didn't know went to jail. Don't do drugs. Drugs are bad, okay? If you do drugs, you're bad. <laughs> Did you fart? No, that was no, my I didn't. Food. Oh, that was your boot. <laughs> I was wondering about that too. Yeah. I know. Yeah. I was like, oh my god. <laughs>